This progression event is called work hard, play hard. Is it the worst progression event we have ever had? Yes, it is. So, I don't recommend it. End of video, right? No. There is a possibility that you can do it with profit. Is it for you? Let's see what is hidden. Please do not forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel and hit that notification bell to be informed for new videos about best strategies, tips and tricks, giveaways and many more. Remember that, in the next days I will upload a video with a giveaway for subscribers to my YouTube channel. The winner will get 50 RLT. In the description you can find the link to the Excel file with the rewards list, plus some more info, like totals, marketplace prices and calculations for the trade strategy, and the loot boxes strategy. So, let's begin. We get 500 points by completing difficulty levels when playing games. We get 1000 points for every RLT spent including crafting or merging. In the marketplace we get 250 points for each RLT spent. It is the lowest until now. Right now we have some coins at 20% discount. It is announced that we will have Shiba at 35% discount on Friday and there will be again a form where you can have a chance to win in my raffle and get back a significant amount of your deposit. Or even more. But watch out. Shiba is on the Ethereum network. So the fees are high. I make a test transaction of moving 15 US dollars and the fees were 6 US dollars. So the 35% discount is lost actually. Although there will be the form for Shiba, I do not recommend to send Shiba. If you want to send any crypto, choose one of the others with 20% discount. If in any case you insist in sending Shiba then you can find the form in the description. Remember you can use a multiplier. Purchase RLT with any crypto you may have already mined or you deposited in the game and multiply the points you get by a certain rate. The goal of the mini event is to reach 3,291,700 points in order to receive the last miner. Let's see the rewards list. There is a battery, a not so good rack and the usual 100 XP. But there is also new rack that is very very good, it will give you 11% rack bonus. There is a small bad miner that can't be sold. And also there is another miner that cannot be sold, the Ferris Wheel Master. At first this seems to be a bad miner. Cannot be sold, 0% bonus. But let's have a look at the parts needed for merging. It is a merging opportunity, and you get two of them from this progression event. After merging, at level 2, it has 1% bonus and 216 th power. Most probably you already have the parts, but even if you do not have them, the cost to buy all of them is about 3.6 RLT. There is also another merging opportunity, but this time you get only one miner. You have to buy the second at 30 RLT from the marketplace. It is the little boxes miner. It has 388 th and 0.5% bonus. The parts cost is about 19 RLT. The total cost for the merge will be 50 RLT, but after merging it has 1 pH power and 2.1% bonus. The last miner we get, as usual, is good. It is called Fun Zone. It has 740 th power and 2% bonus. Let's see the totals. The total power we get in TH is about 2000. That is 2 pH. The total bonus power we get is about 3.25%. The total XP we get is 100. The total RST we get is 35. We also get one good rack and one battery. But with the two merging opportunities one said before, you get finally 2.6% bonus more so totally 5.85% bonus and around 400 th power more. Let's see now the marketplace prices of all the rewards. Lines with gray background means that this miner cannot be sold. Green letters means that is a merging opportunity. If you sell all the rewards you get 173 RLT as a minimum. That's too low. Here is the trade strategy calculations. 
What is this strategy? Is the idea that you can agree with someone else to buy and sell continuously many times the same miner? So you can get many more points, especially when you will have multiplier activated. In the first column is the multiplier. The second column is the RLT you have to purchase for this multiplier, and the dollars you have to spend if you use a crypto with 25% discount. The third column is the total RLT you have to spend totally. At the last column you can see the 5% fee you will lose. So, do not forget that you have to start this strategy with RLT enough to cover the fees and the amount you need to trade each time. Next you can see the calculation for opening many loot boxes strategy. Watch out. The numbers in red, the gain is calculated on average based on statistics. Maybe you gain or lose more. If you open more loot boxes is more probable that you will open a good loot box with many RLT. So the 5 RLT loot boxes is recommended for this strategy. Although I am not fond of the loot box strategy, maybe this time is better because we get 1,000 points. Remember we get 250 points for RLT spent in the marketplace this time. Is it worth it? Big no unless you plan to merge the two merging opportunities. To deposit a crypto with discount for multiplier no less than 6. You are not afraid the loot box strategy. You start with enough RLT to cover the high fees. Plan to spend some RLT in sales where you get 1,000 points. You can use the 12H strategy with multiplier. Or you mine enough crypto every week to have a good multiplier without investing. Remember that, in the next days I will upload a video with a giveaway for subscribers to my YouTube channel. The winner will get 50 RLT.